Hey guys, this is Tech Extreme, and today I'm going to be showing you how to use your Bluetooth keyboard with your Xbox. So, the first thing you're going to want to do is, well, I'm going to go through the requirements first, actually, that would be better. The things you're going to need, you're going to need a key keyboard of your choice, preferably Bluetooth or wireless or wh whatever you want, to be honest. You're gonna need an Xbox. My Xbox is over there, but I'll just show it to you now. There it is. Um, you're going to need a computer running either Windows 8 or Windows 10. The reason why I'm using Windows 8 is because it runs a lot quicker on my computer. But anyways, that's the requirements you're gonna need. You're also going to need your Xbox and your computer to be connected to the same Wi-Fi. Once you have that all figured out, you're going to want to go on to your App Store. For some reason it's not showing my actual camera. I don't know why. Uh, anyways, you go on to your App Store. Then up here, you're going to want to look up Smart Glass. Now this works for the Xbox One or the Xbox 360. I have an Xbox One, so I downloaded the Xbox One app. If you have an Xbox 360, use the Xbox 360 app. So once you have the app installed, you are going to want to go into your applications and just get the app like so. Now I don't know why it's not showing my camera, but just trust me that it works and everything. Okay, so up here you're gonna to wanna to click on your Xbox. I'll just show you what you have to do first. Go up to your Xbox, the Xbox symbol here, click on Evan's Xbox. Um, I'm already connected, but um, if you are not connected, it'll probably come up, turn on, or connect here. I'm not sure which option. But once you are connected, the next thing you're going to want to do is go onto your desktop. And with your keyboard here, you are going to turn it on. Once you have your keyboard turned on, go into this little arrow right here. Right click on Bluetooth and click add a Bluetooth device. Now on your keyboard, you're going to want to click the connect button and hold it down for one or two seconds. Once you've done that, go back into your settings app. Now, my keyboard has just come up here, so I'm going to click Pair. I'll just give it a go again. Okay, so it came up again, this time with the model number. I'm going to click Pair, and then I'm going to type in the little numbers that's told me to type in here so two six zero three six eight one seven once you've typed in that little code press enter and once you have done that just switch over to your xbox app and voila here you go you have your keyboard paired to your computer and your computer is paired to the xbox so what you are going to do now is just use your keyboard on the Xbox. It's really that simple. So on your, let's say if you're on your Xbox or something and you want to send somebody a message, you go up to messages 
and as you can see up here it's giving me a little text bar that I can type stuff into so I can say this I'll just click up here first this is a recorded message if you guys know what that's from let me know in the comments below because I certainly do now I'm just going to say this is a test message respond for YouTube and there you go I'm just going to send that message and I can obviously show it to you on the Xbox because it's a certain contact of mine that I don't want the information to be spread but that's how you basically pair your Bluetooth keyboard to your Xbox within the forms of basically the computer. So yeah, that's the end of this video. If you like the video, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. If you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe as I do awesome videos and you don't want to miss out. And I'll see you in the next one. This is Tech Extreme signing out.